Rejoice, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to be getting Raised by Wolves once more. Now, whether you enjoyed this, like some people, whether you disliked this, like some people, or you were left indifferent, like the majority of people, uh, myself included, Raised by Wolves will be back for its second season, which I will say I am looking forward to, mainly because I, I want to see where this goes, and the actor here in the photo was great. He was absolutely fantastic. Abubakar Salim uh, was great playing father, a superb actor, someone that I want to see more uh, in various things, and also someone who I think has a lot of range, and I, and I want to see that range explored. So I'm looking forward to this, and season two is now officially beginning filming, because we have some behind-the-scenes teaser images courtesy of Abubakar Salim, who plays father. Uh, he posted a picture of himself to Twitter, letting everyone know that they are filming season two. Uh, which, I will say this was a shame. They should have had this ready to go, I think, personally. Uh, HBO Max really dropped the ball on all of this stuff. They had, you know, a, a fair amount lined up, but they didn't have anything banked. And, I, th well, it's, it's not news to anyone, it's pretty there, pretty apparent, is that they launched too soon to try and compete with Disney+. Plus. Um, a massive shame, actually. So this is the image that was posted to his Twitter. Uh, Abubakar Salim, we're back. Big news this week, watch this space. Feeling incredibly fortunate for being here. Thanks to not only the creators and the network, but a big thank you to the people who watch and enjoy the show. Let's have at them. Raised by Wolves Max at Raised Wolves Max at HBO Max. Um, and he doesn't look any different, actually, which he shouldn't, in theory, uh, based on where we saw them. Uh, him and Mother at the end of Season 1, going through the Kepler-22B's core and smashing out the other side with a giant flying serpent uh, in the Tropical Zone. So, he shouldn't look any different, quite frankly. Uh, he should look pretty much the same. Uh, there is no release date. As this Collider article states, no release date yet. Um, we don't know how long they've been shooting for now. Um, it, I guess we could say, look, you know, a bit of deduction going on here. We had it announced anyway that, you know, it's premiered September 2020. The series was renewed for a second season only a couple of weeks later. So let's, um, let's say October. It was announced. Um, I believe it wasn't, actually. I believe it was announced a little bit uh, after that. But let's say it was October. They've only just started shooting now uh, in March. There's a fair amount of visual effects involved in this show. A lot of it is on location, and they have some beautiful locations. I mean, this is a fantastic set uh, location. Uh, but them shooting in March... I, I think they may be able to push out a season by September, maybe, if they're if they're working to a really tight schedule. But I don't think so. I think it'll probably air in spring of 2022, which will be way too long between seasons. Way too long. And I think that's a shame. Now, this article just, you know, specifically state where they last left off. Anyway, we last saw our dynamic couple, mother and fa father, attempting to kill mother's terrifying snake baby by flying a ship into one of the mysterious never-ending tunnels before shooting out the other side. Based on the green foliage and blue skies, it looks like they might be in the tropical zone. The That uh, amalgamated family discussed traveling to throughout the, season, the, the series. Uh, it seems as though mother and father simply traveled through the entire planet and emerged on the other side while the ever-growing baby flew or slithered away unharmed. And that's the thing. Where are they going to go with this season? Where are they going to go? Um, I hope that this has payoff. I really, really do. Uh, but I am... I'm interested. I'm interested. Uh, I didn't like the first few episodes. I thought they were pretty lazy. Uh, and I do think there's a lot of inconsistencies with the season on a whole. A lot of people, uh, sadly and wrongly claim that Ridley Scott is the man behind this. He's actually not. 
he's only the producer uh, and he directed one episode. Now the writer, uh, the man behind all of this is someone else entirely, uh, Aaron Guzikowski. Uh, he wrote it, he is the creator, uh, and yeah, this has nothing to do with Ridley Scott, really. Now a lot of people will say, yeah, but there's so many things which are, are the same, it's definitely in the Alien universe. Um, no, not, not strictly speaking. Uh, Ridley Scott, as executive producer, will obviously be drawn to things that he likes. And we know that he likes this sort of story. You know, exploring religion, alien life, humanity. Uh, he clearly loves his synthetics. Um, and undoubtedly there will be some level of design cues that came from Ridley Scott. Uh, with respect to Alien and things like that. I mean, even these costumes are pretty much the same. But that's only because Ridley Scott has executive producer uh, credit, so you would have creative control. Because I believe it's actually produced by his production company, um, Scott Free. Or is it Brandywine? I can't remember. No, Brandywine is... Uh, Brandywine is David, David Giller and Walter Hill, if I remember rightly. Um, but anyway, whatever, it doesn't matter. My point is, is that uh, Ridley Scott is the is one of the key executive producers on here. So I think any it, it, it's going to be a, a shame if it goes nowhere. I really hope it does. They've already had tie-in comics, so I hope there's some payoff. But anyway, I have rambled far too much uh, about Raised by Wolves. I'm looking forward to it. Please don't expect it anytime soon. Uh, I think that you know it, it's not going to happen anytime soon. We will not be, uh, we will not be revisiting this anytime soon. We did have revealed to us anyway that it would be five or six seasons uh, by the creator Guzikowski. So hopefully, there's some bloody payoff. There's too many things now that have been revealed and released that don't have payoff. They build for an entire season, and especially if they're just one season alone. Uh, they don't have appropriate payoff. We need to get back to actually paying people off. So, yeah, anyway, it's here. It's being filmed. I anticipate it probably being released spring of 2022 at a push this year, but very unlikely. Let me know what you think, though, ladies and gents. Let me know down below in the comment section. Did you enjoy this? Did you... Were you ambivalent to it? We just... Ugh, I'm not sure. Let me know down below. Cheers. Take care.